It was very strange bringing Banks back. I wanted to bring him back. I'd, I'd done one book without him uh, before The Poison, which I loved doing, and it took a little bit longer than the usual Banks book did. So I'd been away a long time. And also in that interim period, I'd seen the TV series as well, uh, which you know was based on books, but was not really like the books, and had a, an actor, Stephen Tompkinson, playing Banks. So getting back to writing about Banks was more difficult than I thought it would be. I had to sort of reclaim him. But it, it was a good process, and, and I really enjoyed writing about him again. And I think um, I, I got the hang of him pretty quickly. I think the qualities I admire most in Banks are, are, are that he's curious about all manner of things, you know, people, life, history, whatever. He's, he's, he's got a very eager, curious mind. And he also has a, a fairly broad uh, sense of compassion in that, you know, he, he often understands what motivates people, he, even the wrongdoers. I'm not saying that he forgives them, he doesn't get angry, he, you know, he does all those things. But, you know, he has, he has a, a deep understanding of human nature and its foibles, and I think that helps him do the job he does. It's hard for me to know how Banks has developed over the years because I've been developing alongside him, or I've been developing him. I mean, I'm, I'm not crazy enough to think he's a real person. You know, he's not my imaginary friend who I have little conversations with. But obviously he's, you know, he's aged as I have and, and he's been through various things. He's been through divorce, he's been through problems at work and given his job, of course, he's, he's, he's dealt with some, some pretty horrendous crimes and it's bound to change him in some ways. He hasn't become cynical, and I, and I like that about him too. I mean, it's not, the job hasn't soured him on life and people in general. Um, but uh, I, I think really he's probably become more introspective, more philosophical, and a little more distant from the rest of the world over the series. He was far more outgoing at first, and yeah, he had all kinds of little interests, and uh, now he, he'd rather sit by himself and drink a glass of wine and listen to a string quartet.